OK, autumn is here, which means winter is just around the corner. We're talking today about what we can do to prepare ourselves for those colder months. Here with some advice, Dr Emma Parry with Livestream range of products, which is available at Health 2000. Good morning, Emma. Good morning, Holly. OK, so is there really anything we can do to, like, um, prep our health before the winter ills hit? Yeah, absolutely. So as you know, I'm always here talking about gut health. Yes. And uh, the gut is actually a really important organ to get right. Um, we think of the gut as being very much around, you know, food and absorption, but it has a really big role to play in immunity. And as we're coming into winter, then we should think about getting our gut health good. Okay, so um, our immune system functions are actually affected by our gut health. Yeah, that's right. How does that work? I know, it kind of feels a bit crazy. So essentially our gut is lined by a whole bunch of bacteria and those bacteria do a fantastic job of helping to um, process food, aid ab absorption, uh, but they're also there to uh, line the gut and protect the gut in a sort of a colony called the microbiome. And what that does is it protects the gut from other bacteria or nasties that might be affecting it. And the thing that we know is that the cells that line the gut are not just cells which uh, are involved with absorption of food. There's also f cells with all sorts of other functions, so um, the nervous system, um, endocrines are hormones, but also immunity. And around 80% of our immune cells are actually in our guts. It's huge, right? Yeah. So what can we be doing to help our gut health? Yeah, so um, I think one of the things that I think is really important um, at times when you know that immunity needs to be boosted is to think about taking a probiotic. Now what a probiotic does is it's basically about trying to make sure that the microbiome, the colony of bacteria in our gut, is the good bacteria rather right. than the bad bacteria and so helps support the cells of the gut lining, including those immune cells. Okay, so um, you brought along a product today from Health 2000, which you think can help. I'll just pick this up so we can have a look. Can you tell us more about this? Yeah, so this is the advanced probiotics from Lifestream, and it contains 14 strains of probiotics, and these have been um, shown to help benefit the, the gut health. So they'll help for those general gut things, so like helping if you've got things like bloating, but they're also um, uh, helpful in terms of helping the immune system and sometimes um, the immune system can be um, really important in terms of all parts of health not just immunity and ensuring that we can defend against infections right but also things like skin health and making sure that our skin is healthy as well all right talk more about that so our gut health can actually affect our skin appearance yes. and health Yes. Okay. It's, it's kind of crazy, isn't it? So it's everything. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you think of the gut as sort of being inside here and nothing to do with the outside. But your skin is, um, is something that we look at every day, so we kind of can check it. I had my mole map last week, so I'm feeling quite proud of you. I got that done. Yeah. But um, you can check your skin and you can see if it's healthy. And um, when our immunity is being challenged, then sometimes we can see in our skin, our skin doesn't look healthy. Okay. And so um, if we see that our skin is not looking healthy, then it's a good idea at that time to think, about well how is our gut doing 80% of those immune cells sit in the gut mm -hmm. and how are they doing in terms of do they need a bit of nurturing and looking after so interesting you could talk about this forever I know yeah you could. totally yeah. all right last question when should you take your probiotic yeah, well, I think at the moment, coming into winter, we're all thinking about how we can uh, protect our immunity. Now is a great time to start taking a probiotic. Um, I think if you've got particular gut problems, this is great for gut problems. Mm -hmm. So bloating, um, uh, uh, um, uncomfortable, get your gut right. The other thing is that, you know, if you've had to have a course of antibiotics, mm -hmm. and the thing about antibiotics is what they do is they're great for treating the infection you're trying to treat, but they also really upset the bacteria in the gut. And so what can happen is that some of those nasty bacteria can get overgrown to the detriment of the good ones. And so taking a probiotic with antibiotics and afterwards for a while is a really good solution to that. Okay, so can you double up the dose or do you just take your one in the morning? So you can double up the dose and we'd recommend that around the time, particularly if you'd had some antibiotics. Yeah. yeah, okay, fantastic. Great advice as always. Thank you so much, Emma. And Dr. Emma has brought along Livestream Advanced Probiotic for everyone in the audience today. Lucky you. And it's available at Health 2000 stores. Just ask their friendly staff to point you in the right direction.